And now we head over to the National Election Commission. Our Lee kyung -un is standing by there to tell us more about the voting process and the voter turnout so far. kyung -un, what's the latest? Hi, Devin. So we're inching closer to the final voter turnout, and the National Election Commission here has been keeping track of those numbers on a real-time basis. And as of 4 p.m., the figure is at 59.7 percent, and that's about 9.5 percentage points higher than at the same time from the previous election. That's also well above the final turnout of that election. It's mainly attributed to the early voter turnout, which has been included as of 1 p.m. Despite concerns due to coronavirus outbreak, this year's early voter turnout has hit a record high of 26.7 percent. Right now, Cheollanam, the province, has the highest turnout with over 63.2 percent. It has also the highest participation for early voting last weekend. But much attention is also on the southeastern city of Daegu, the city hardest hit by the COVID-19 outbreak in South Korea. Traditionally, Daegu's turnouts were among the country's lowest, but this year the city is seeing some unprecedented developments, including clinching tough spot briefly this morning. It seems like COVID-19 has drawn people closer to politics, not away from it. Now the polling stations will close at 6 p.m., but the official final turnout will not be announced until very late at night. In all five previous general elections, only once in 2004 has the country seen a turnout at over 60 percent. But based on the current trend, this year's final turnout could easily surpass that milestone. Devin?